This parish has wanted a high school for a long time. A lot of the parishioners, when we announced it, especially a lot of the older parishioners, uh, were very excited at the, the prospects of us actually finally having a high school. So this is a great alternative for our, our families, especially our Catholic families, to say, I want to continue with that faith-based education for the kids. This is why I talk about the perfect storm here in Albany. You know, the pub private schools are very expensive. The public schools are overcrowded. Um, and, and now we have a, an option to have a school that is um, not as expensive, smaller classes, great teachers, good administration, um, and new. We provide kids with not just the academics, not just the faith, but the nurturing that they need. You know, if a kid's having a bad day, they can come in and tell their teacher, you know, like my cat just died, or my grandmother's sick in the hospital. Can we pray, please pray for her? You know, it, those things that, that we can do here at St. Teresa's that you can't do in the public school. Many years, um, the salutatorians and the valedictorians of the um, public schools and even some of the private schools had their foundation in the elementary school of St. Teresa's. But those things, those same things you loved about elementary school here at St. Teresa's are the same things that you're going to love about St. Teresa's High School. You're going to have those experience of formals and homecomings and sports and, you know, after school clubs and, you know, being able to have your own parking space at the school and things like that. It's just going to be different. The foundation that they get here and will build towards college. To me, there's no greater gift you can give your children than a Catholic education.